10 intrepid, technologically adept travelers started a journey from New York's Silicon Alley to San Francisco's Silicon Valley. Kind of like a digital road rally, if you will, this trip was intended to show how wireless technologies, such as cell phones and modems, can link together people in different parts of the country. My guest is Courtney Pulitzer, one of the travelers on the Alley to the Valley Rally, as the trip was called, and welcome to the program. Thank you. It really does seem like this high-tech search for the American spirit would sum up what you did. Do you agree? Yes. Um, I think foremost one of the things that we really were excited about was this was the Great American Road Trip, getting to drive across the country, um, see all the different little small towns along the way, um, and also with the focus of the technology that's out there testing it mm -hmm. and um, and what the cyber scene is in all these different little towns. Before we get to all those scenes, tell mm -hmm. us a little bit more about it. This was, it began two years ago, and yes. where did you, you traveled from New York to San Francisco? My home is out there, so uh -huh. talk about all the things in between, what you saw and the experiences that you had. Um, well, there were four teams, and for the most part we traveled together. Um, most of the, the main points were Nashville, um, St. Louis, Denver, um, N Burning Man Festival in Nevada, and then San Francisco. And I think most of our experiences were the, uh, the thrill of meeting people in cafes and, and different road stops along the way, um, talking to them about our websites, and um, finding out that a lot of people out there actually do have sites of their own. As you are talking, we do have your website available, mm -hmm. and uh, Terry Spataro, who is with Stir Associates, one of your sponsors, will be driving that website for mm -hmm. us. Here we have it here. Talk a little bit about this, and then let's get to what your findings were, which I imagine was that there is a tremendous awareness of technology. Yes, uh, there really is. Um, right now, this is one of the journal entries for Team GCDI, which designed the uh, website for the entire rally. And what they did is they have a contact sheet of their images that they took with their digital camera. Um, and you can click on each image, whichever one you want, and um, get a, a larger image of, of that. Um, each team has their own journal entry site where they ha maintain their journals and pictures. And also, three times a week, you had an opportunity for people to chat online. Yes, actually, we did um, six chats, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, for two weeks with AOL on the Hub Heaven, and I did a chat with the At New York newsletter from the St. Louis Post-Dispatch headquarters in St. Louis. With your findings, did it confirm what you all felt you knew, or were there some surprises? Um, there were surprises. Such I, as? Um, I was amazed at how um, people were, were not skeptical. I thought they might think, you know, the internet and, and not really understand it or, or care. And a lot of people were really enthusiastic and really wanted to um, know more and actually had websites of their own. Mm -hmm. uh, some of the frustrating parts were the actual um, using the technology on the roads. But for the most part, the people we met were genuinely interested and really uh, excited about the different technology we were using. Let's talk the money of this. How much did the trip cost on average? And what about sponsors? Um, I'd say individually, we all probably spent at least two thousand maybe more dollars out of pocket personal so it was it was a, a bit of an expensive trip for some of us but certainly well worth it we did have sponsorship um, from stir associates from at new york from aol um, at&t uh, team gcdi um, cd now so we did have um, a lot of sponsors who mostly donated um, goods some money and uh, definitely um, the spirit um, of, of this trip and what about future plans plans to do this again definitely um, probably I think right now it's every two years um, although there's been so much interest it may go into a yearly event mm -hmm. and at the conclusion of it all I mean if you had to sum up what the various teams I'm sure you all had kind of a postmortem got together and talked about this what would you say overall was the experience and how you would categorize the experience the experience was uh, intensely dramatic um, in terms of seeing the country, um, frustrations with the technology, and also um, thrills with the technology. So it was it was definitely um, an intense experience, with both with highs and lows. Are you going to sign up for the next trip when it comes around? Most definitely. And start mm -hmm. saving your money, maybe a little pricier next time, too. <laughs> right. Thank you very much, Courtney Pulitzer, for joining us today. Silicon Alley Gossip columnist, we appreciate it. Thank you. Okay.